I'm Todd Bridges, and I'm watching Studio Q. What you talking about, Willis? Studio Q Show. Now you know. I you know you're an icon. Come on now. Thank you. Why is it important for somebody to come out and support like independent films like this? I've been knowing Mario Van Peebles forever. Yeah. So a lot of the biggest problem we have in our community is we don't come out to support each other. Yeah. That's one of the biggest problems. So now I'm now I, I, I stayed in for about four years. And now I'm coming out now to support my people and their projects because I feel that's very important because I have things, something I want to pass on to my people too. And that's why with this new show and what I'm about to start teaching our people is forgiveness and how to forgive not just what we've done to one another, but what people have done to us. If you want them to change, we got to change. And that's, a, that's the thing that, that we don't seem to understand. People got mad like recently at that, the, um, that, that brother for hugging that woman that shot his brother, but that was the only way for him to let go of that hate and the anger. That was right there was showing what Jesus can do. Okay, but what about the judge and what about the other lady what doing the her judge, hair? What the judge a, Bible a Bible and a hug. Okay, my judge hugged me and she was white. So what Wow. Did okay, what about the combing of the hair? You know something? She probably knew that officer. Right or wrong. She probably just, knew her. I'm just, I'm just giving you what no, the critics give. Okay, but, but let me there's a you, lot of stuff on Instagram tell you this, about But let me that. tell you this. Her life is over. She's going to be a felon and a police officer in jail. Over. It can't but, come back. But five years, Todd? No. Ten. I know, but she probably only going to serve five. A police officer in jail, she's going to get beat up every day. No, I don't want that. I'm telling you it already. Yeah. I've, been, I've been in that place before. I know what happens to police officers. So tell us, how can we forgive? What is the biggest thing that because can help us? We have to start looking to God and do exactly what he's telling us to do. If we want, if we want people to change, we want the other side to change, we got to change. We, we sling more mud at each other, our own kind, than they sling at us. You know, so that's, that's what, what upsets me more than anything is that we want to blame, 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 but we're not looking at ourselves. You know, I can't blame anybody for all my past issues. I, you know, I messed up some stuff, but God got me out of it and straightened me up because I trusted him and believed in him. And, I, and the, most person, the biggest person I forgave was myself. And that's the thing you have to really learn to do is forgive yourself. You know, and then everything else falls into place. And also, you have to love yourself. I don't care what nobody, I don't care if nobody like me. I love me. And that, and my kids love me. My mother loved me. My brother loved me and my sister loved me. But how long was that journey? That journey was only, uh, I, I've been, uh, it was only for four years. But see, I've been just hiding away, waiting to come back out. Because see, I had to get away from, you know, like, you know, the media does attack. And they attacked me ridiculously. It, I, I ain't been in trouble in 26 years, but they act like I've been in trouble yesterday. I've been sober for 26 years, but they act like I've been so I ain't been sober. Oh yeah, but they act like I haven't been. You know, and, and the reason why you know I am because I ain't getting arrested. That proves it right there. Well, we love you, Todd. Thank you. And we thank you for coming thank out. You so much. Appreciate God you. God and we're looking you. for that new project. Yes, you're gonna love it. Trust me, you're gonna love it. <laughs>